What prosecutors are calling a deadly shooting war between teenage gangs. Prosecutors in Milwaukee police revealing the rival groups may be at the heart of the shooting following the Juneteenth celebration. 12 News Nick Boer shows us the children caught in the turmoil. In a moment of rage following Milwaukee's Juneteenth celebration, six people shot, ranging in age from 14 to 19. They all survived. A 15-year-old boy now facing charges in juvenile court, shedding light on a simmering, deadly shooting war between two loosely organized gangs. According to the juvenile petition, a fight started between two groups, one calling themselves the Kia Boys, the other the Via Boys. That dispute was broken up by deputies, but it spilled over about half a block away where the shooting took place. The court documents reveal the troubling trend and consequences, stating, quote, literally dozens of children have shot and been shot as a result of these gangs. Both adults and children have been injured in the crossfire as a result of robberies, car thefts, carjackings, and reckless driving. Milwaukee police tell us they couldn't discuss the issue further, quote, as there are ongoing investigations regarding this feud. But last month, Chief Jeffrey Norman pointed to what he called cliques of teens behind street crimes. There's no glory attached to being involved in a group that shoots and kills for silly things like social media posts or disrespect. It's, this isn't going to stop overnight. This is going to take time. Reverend Marty Calderon once ran the streets hanging out with gang members. Now he works with Milwaukee's Office of Violence Prevention. His team, Unify, focuses on street outreach, working for decades to defuse violent conflicts between gangs. It's very dangerous because there's a lot of innocent bystanders, you know, people who aren't involved in um, anything that is in that those individuals' lifestyle but they bring people in it because of car chases, because of uh, drive-by shootings. Calderon says the escalation is more motivation to develop connections with the members to turn them away from that criminal lifestyle. In Milwaukee, Nick Bohr, WISN 12 News.